I'm walking in the middle of the street. And he just starts going ape shit. Put your hands on your back. I got it. Get the fuck off. Smackers! Mother! The fuck, sir? Calm down. Sir, calm down. Fuck off of me! You're not taking me out with them, sir! You okay, sir? Yeah, I got this. Fuck off! Fuck off! Sir, please calm down. We just want to help. Why don't you just leave me alone? Just stay calm and we can sort all of this out and get you whatever help you need, okay? What's your name? Freddy. Okay, Freddy. PC Matthews is gonna take you to an interview room and get you a coffee. Just stay calm, I promise you everything will be okay. Sure you're okay. Look, just ignore Matthews, he can be a bit of a dick. I'm fine. It's not that he just doesn't like a woman outranking him. He's an old sweat, I get it. I just pissed off that I fucked up in there. I should have secured that cup. We all fuck up. Put it right, that's all that matters. Is there a unit free that can deal with a suicide? I'll take this one. I need to get out of here for a bit. Whiskey Zulu 200 to comms. I'll take this one. Go ahead. Thanks, son. We have a report of a suicide at Lifton Farm. Caller is a Mrs. Peters, a deceased wife. Are you okay to check this out in the first instance? ARVs? Are there any ARVs able to assist? Let me check, Sarge. No, they're all committed. I will get one to the station to collect the shotgun as soon as one becomes available. Best I can do. It's going to take him hours to get here from the city. Can you give me an ETA on the ARV? Negative. We are ready. Whiskey Zulu 20 to comms, come in please. Whiskey Zulu 20 to comms, can you hear me? It's fine. Happens a lot out here. Whiskey Zulu 86, can you read me? We can still use the channel. It's just comms that have got the problem. I'm sure they'll be back on soon. Well, I will keep trying comms en route. Just make sure you keep monitoring. Will do. Catch you later. Dad. Please, let me do that for you. Thank you. Maybe your hands are a little steadier. Is that an American accent? No, Canadian. I transferred to England from Toronto. Oh, I see, dear. I know it's hard, but would you mind if I took a few more details from you? Of course, dear. You carry on. So, what time did Mr. Peters return home? Oh, please. He would have preferred you call him John. It, it was about a quarter to six, and he seemed fine. He had a nice time down the pub and was looking forward to his teeth. And you can't think of any reason John would have taken his life, any health problems, financial difficulties? No, John was as fit as a fiddle. He walked everywhere. He still looked after that farm. It, it's just not like him. 
so sorry. Oh, I'll be okay, dear. W would you like a biscuit? Was John a keen gardener as well as working the farm? Not really. John only did what he had to when it came to the garden. Did you manage to get a hold of your sister? No, no, th that phone's still not working. Oh. Okay. Let me try and get a message to her. What's her number? Oh, that would be wonderful, dear. It's Exborn, two one three, nine five nine. Okay. Whiskey Zulu two zero to front office. Matthews, are you receiving? Matthews here. Go ahead. I'm trying to get a hold of Mrs. Peter's sister. Can you try to reach her your end? Sorry, Sarge. The phone's down across the whole area, including the station. It was my fault. Mrs. Peters, it was please. It my fault. My God, I'm fault. Please, just put it the was gun my down. Fault. My God, I'm fault. My Mrs. God, Peters, I'm please, fault. just... Zero to whiskey zero eight six. Go ahead. Hey Patrick, I've had another suicide. I've had to lock the scene down until I can get a hold of someone to put the balloon up. It's not ideal, but hey, I can't sit there all night. I'm heading back to the station now. Zoe, we've had word of a disturbance at the tavern. Not sure what's going on, but I'm making my way there now. Zoe. Yeah. I'll get back to you. Let me in. It's trying to get in there. 
house. What is? Are you alone in the house? It's come back for me. It wants me. It wants me. Sir, there is a lady in the road outside your house. Do you know what happened to her? in the house. Whiskey Zulu 20 to Whiskey Zulu 86, urgent. Can anybody hear me? I need another unit. Oh, Patrick, can you hear me? Hi, Zoe. Go ahead. Patrick, I saw it again. I mean, this time I really saw it. There's something out here attacking people like an unconscious man with severe injuries and a dead female. How to explain it. Okay, well, keep calm. How bad is the male? I don't know. Uh, I think he's alive. Right, then I'll try comms again and get back to you.
Whiskey Zulu 20 to Whiskey Zulu 83. Matthews, are you receiving? Whiskey Zulu 20 to Whiskey Zulu 86. Patrick, are you receiving? Patrick! Whiskey Zulu 20 to Whiskey Zulu 86. Patrick, are you receiving? Patrick, I'm heading straight to the city now to get help. Patrick? Patrick! Patrick?
what the fuck happened to him? It's a landlord. He just started going nuts. We had to do this to him to stop him from killing himself. You're gonna have to choke him again. On three. One, two, three. Is he okay? I don't know. I'll stay here and check him over. It's okay. He's a vet. Come through here and keep as quiet as you can. You're okay. out there. We've seen the ships. Yeah, we've seen them. It's fucking aliens. They're fucking with our brains and killing us. Now you've brought them back here. Robbie, will you calm the fuck down? Look, they must have followed me here from their roadblock, but I don't think they saw me come in. Roadblock? Yeah, the main city road and the old back road. Great. Can't see anything happen. They moved off. How many shells you got left? I got three left. Well, what about the news? Anybody see any TV? Not really. Yeah, it's as if nothing's happening. Just another day. I do think it's just this area they're attacking. Why? What do they want? We live in the middle of fucking nowhere. What can they possibly have to gain from attacking us? They want to expand. Experiment with us, and it ain't the first time either. Three years ago, I had one of them circles in the middle of my club. Got up in the morning, and there it was. And then I found that butchered two of my prize bulls, mutilated them, and you lot didn't want to do nothing. Trying to control us. He's right. They want our land. If it isn't the immigrants, it's the blading aliens. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, Dale, I don't think I need to come all this way for a bit of your hay and British beef. Who cares what it is or what it wants? How are we going to get out of here? Okay, everybody, we need to calm down. She's right. We just need to focus on getting ourselves to safety. How's he doing in there? Uh, he's still out cold. I'm just going to finish cleaning up his wounds, try and stop any further infections. That's all I can do. Okay. Is there any other way we can make contact with Combs, trying to get some help? No. The phones are down and there's been nothing from them on the radios. Perhaps they blocked the frequency. Patrick, what channel does the city use? 149. What good is that? That thing won't reach the city. Doesn't have to. There should be an ARV unit from the city in the area by now. Whiskey Zulu 2020 units, come in please. ARV? Armed response vehicle. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Now you're talking. Whiskey Zulu 2020 units, come in please. No. Wait. The ARV used a different channel. It's. Four, six, seven, I think. Whiskey Zulu 2020 to units, come in, please. Hello, Whiskey Zulu 20. This is Delta Tango 46. We are en route to the station. Delta Tango, we are in urgent need of assistance. Can you get through to comms? We've lost contact. Members of the public and are under siege. What's your ETA at the station? We're about 12 miles. Wow. Start lightning again. Damn it. 
Delta Tango, come in, please. I to the fragrances. Delta Tango, come in, please. We're all fucked. Look, we know they're gonna be at the station. We just need to get ourselves there. There are more shells for the shotgun at the station. What's back there? It's where they attacked. Sorry. They killed everyone in there. We only managed to escape by hiding in the skidder alley. No, don't. They might be in there again. You'll let them in. There might still be somebody alive in there. There's nothing we could do. Drive. Can you see anything? No, nothing. They're not following us. Fuck, oh, Petra, see the size of those things. Have you seen any of those already? No. Then you. That's a lot of blood. Yeah, and that 
bags, some um, bandages and vodka. Why aren't they coming after us? Maybe they don't need to. Okay, what's the plan? Get to the station and wait for the ARV. What if they're watching the roads? Maybe they're not watching all of them. We need to at least try. What about Claire and Isaac? I hope they're all right. I've gone to Cornwall for the weekend, visiting Gran. Is Jason in the city? Yeah. How are you holding up? I ain't got an after I just can't seem to get enough pressure on it. Fuck. The landlord did that? He woke up and just started chomping down on my hand. Is he still back there? No, he went out the back. I couldn't stop him. What the fuck is happening to people? What are those things doing to them? Hey, the kid said it's mind control. Controlling our minds so that we hurt ourselves? So we kill ourselves. But why? Stop the car. So that they can take over. Hey, seriously. Let's stop the car. I don't think they need mind control to take over. Stop the fucking car. I think it's an infection. I think they're infecting us with something, maybe a virus. Aggression. Confusion, self-harm, they're all symptoms of a brain infection. Why kill us with a virus? Why not? Maybe we're just an experiment. Lab rats. So now you think you're infected? Robbie and Sarah haven't been attacked by anyone or anything. Like, you don't know that's how it's transmitted. True. Well, there's a good chance I am now, and you'll all be safer if you get me out of the car. I think he's right. I think we should let him out. Keep driving. dealt with four suicides today and only one of them have been attacked. If this is a virus, then it seems to be affecting everybody. And if any one of us starts showing symptoms, I would rather you were around and lying on the roadside bleeding to death. Let's just get to the station. I think so. Can't see their car. Get them in. I'm gonna go and check the side door is locked. I'll see you back at the front desk. Sounds good. See you in five.
Can't you know? Sorry. Is that? He's gone. How are we supposed to fight these things? All those people and their Matthews. I tried to stop him, but I couldn't get to him. Hey, hey, hey. I know. It's okay. You can't save everyone, Zoe. Just concentrate on getting the rest of us out of here, okay? Come on, Zoe. We need you. Okay. 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 Let's get to the property store and get to that ammo. We just have to hold out until the ARV unit arrives. Yes, Sarge. How's the hand? Probably not going to be writing any prescriptions for a while. Can I take a look? Probably best not to. Not until I can change the dressing. So what's a Canadian doing in our sleepy rural police force? I transferred here with my fiancé to be closer to his parents. They had found it. Oh, in the city, thank God. This was the closest posting I could get. Not what you're used to. No, not really. Actually, I was disappointed I couldn't get a more exciting post in the city. What time did all this start today? Um, Mr. Peters was the first, I guess, about 6 p.m. God, he shot himself just after he got home from the pub. What time did he get to the pub? Oh, I don't know. Why is that important? Okay. Shh. Look at the size of them. They're just standing there watching. Do you think they know we're in here? So that's a safe bed. What happens if they get in here? Maybe they already are. Okay, we need to search the rest of the building and make sure it's secure. We could be here a while. Oh! That's all we've got. Look, it's going to take forever to search this place of those two. Okay, well, let's get them somewhere safe and you and I can search. The cells. They're cut off from the main corridors. That's good. There's medical supplies there, too. Can you carry him? Sure. Dale, grab the other arm. Can't you take that one? Oh, for fuck's sake. Uh. 
Where's everybody else? We're pretty much it. Cutbacks. The station isn't used much anymore. Everything goes through the city. Why is it so big? It used to be an old MOD training post. I guess now they just don't know what to do with it. Oh. Base of the thumb, as tight as you can. What? Like that. Hey, Dale, are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Don't worry about me. That? Okay. That okay. Look, you try and get some reservoir, Patrick, and I secure the station. Okay. Yeah, I will. Ready? Yep. Dale, you're gonna have to lock the door behind us. <sighs> yeah. Okay. First we'll check down here and then we'll start a sweep upstairs. The East Corridor was secure. How were things when you came around the back? All good. Most of those rooms are locked anyway. Okay. That just leaves that corridor on the west side. And that'll lead us to the stairwell. We're trying to help you here. You're so fucking special! Freddy, drop the knife. Put the knife down now. What have you got here? I'll kill you, Freddy, fuckers! Put the knife Freddy, you're trying to here, sneak up on me! Freddy, I'll stab everyone of you, fuckers! Drop the knife. We're all in trouble here. Drop the knife. We're all in trouble here. Motherfuckers!
carry on? Yeah. I'll be fine. Good. I had to wrestle him into one of the cells. Hear voices, and uh, the banging. I just wasn't sure. Wasn't sure about what? Uh, my head is killing me. What happened? He got stabbed by a prisoner. Uh, bastard! How many of them are out there? Too many. Any sign of the ARV guys? No. Looks like we're on our own. It's okay. I can walk from here. You okay? It's just a headache. I can take you from here. Okay, good. I'm gonna go check on Dale. You do some help. I don't need any help. Get yourself my help. I'm sorry. I'm just feeling a little stressed at the moment. I, 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 I'm not feeling myself. I'm fine. Fine. The closer those things get, the crazier people start acting. Uh, I know. Mitchell's not looking too good either. But if the ARV unit doesn't arrive, I we're going to be... I know. I know. Look. Well, think of something, okay? I mean, as long as these doors hold, then we're safe in here, right? I guess. Is that way? Better get out of here. Try again, try again. <laughs> 
Where's Zoe? Hey, Mitchell. You okay? Yeah, fine. Where's Zoe? He's down the other end. What are you up to? I haven't seen any of them out there for a while. If we could get to the other side, we could get to the rear exit in the Land Rover. Yeah, it could work. How's that arm? You think you can get through there? Yeah, not a problem. What about Mitchell? He's getting worse. Yeah. He's not great, but we don't have many options here. Okay. Let's do it. Hey, Mitchell. How are you feeling? What time is it? Look, we think we found a way out of here. Do you think you're okay to move? A way out? Why? Why do we want to get out? Okay, buddy. Come on. Time to move. Are they coming back yet? Mitchell, you have to be quiet. Can you do that? Is there anybody else in the building? 
Look out! Managed to grab an extra mag. We must be almost out. Thanks. So what now? Where do we go? More people will have to come see. Those things can't keep us cut off forever. Until then, we just need to find somewhere safe to lay low. Maybe we should stay off the main roads. I figured it out. What is it, Mitchell? What have you figured out? The farm. What farm? You got to the farm before Patrick got to the park. So what does that mean? You're next. I don't even remember leaving the fucking handgun in there. <laughs> this ain't over yet. I know. We keep fighting. Yeah.
Hey, Zoe. What is it? Someone's coming. Let's see what he knows. You okay? I heard the gunshots. We're fine. Any of those things out here? No, don't think so. I haven't seen any for a couple of hours, but I wouldn't go any further that way if I was you. They've got the road blocked. Shit. Look, we can't stay out in the open like this. Is your house close by? Yeah, just a little up the road there. Come on, this way, before we're spotted. I thought you buggers were meant to be rescuing me. When's the cavalry coming? Our comms have been down. We haven't been able to get word out. Figures. Check the back. Anything? No. I think we're good. Is there anybody else here? No. Bastards got to my Cathy at the beginning of all this. I'm sorry. I'll get more of them though, before it's over. Drink. That cut out about an hour ago. So, did you get any of them? We shot some of those machines, but it doesn't make a difference. What about those big buggers? Have you noticed how they keep their distance? Bloody cowards. It's the drones. They're the ones that do the dirty work. What happened here? <sighs> Me and the wife were having a row about something. All of a sudden she starts to go nuts. She's shaking like she's having a fit. But her feet, her feet are barely touching the ground. And that's when I saw it. By the time I'd grabbed my shotgun, she was already lying on the floor and that thing was stood there in all its glory. Bam, I shot it, point blank. And it was when I noticed one of the big ones looking in through the window. And I missed him, but I went outside and I cornered him by the barn. He knew exactly what I had in my hand. He backed into that barn like a little girl. I bet he's in there now, wishing he never came to this house. Are you saying that you've got one of those things locked in your barn? Oh, don't worry, love. He's not going anywhere. Do you want to see it? Oh, you're going to love this. You're going to bloody love this. I know. I know. Let's just take a look. How bad is it? I'm okay. It's fine. The 
there's any reward, it's my find, okay? Fine. I hope you're not squeamish. In war, son. Fight in the fight. What have you been doing? This. Now, this is not fighting. We need to show these bastards who they're messing with. Look. Oh, 
come on. Let's go. Come on! Any other weapons? Why are they not just killing us on sight? I don't know. It's so cold. Shit. There's more of them. Come on, Zoe. God, look at these people. Ah, my fucking head is killing me. You okay? Hang in there. Patrick, what's the point in running? Look, don't give up. We keep going. No, wait. Ma'am, are you okay? Do you feel okay? I think I've been asleep. Please take a seat. What happened to you? I, I can't remember. I don't know. <laughs> Sir, do you feel okay? It's okay, he's fine. What's going on? What are you doing here? It's okay, sir. Please, stay calm. It's okay, take it easy. Everybody's fine. Everybody's okay. What have I done? Sorry, keep it together. 
You didn't do anything. Think about it. Mitchell, back at the station, he had it all figured out. Mitchell was crazy. He was trying to kill himself and us. Oh, no, 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 no. He was, he was going crazy, but he wasn't there yet. He was trying to save himself, and I didn't let him. Stopping them. Zoe, come on, you're losing it. Stay with me. We can get through this. Did I kill all those people? Zoe, come on. I need your help. Wait, wait. Look at it. What if it's not a soldier? What if it's a fucking medic? Snap out of it. God, he was right. It started at the farm. Something happened to that farmer and it spread. Just stop. What are you doing? It's okay, Patrick. I know what I'm doing now. Zoe, don't! Zoe, no! Fight it! Zoe! Out of my way! Get out of my way! Zoe! Zoe! Bastards! <laughs>